morning. <laughs> Good morning. This feels so foreign. I have not had a camera in my face, darling, in some time. <clears throat> Please don't, please don't mind this background. I have officially moved to Atlanta. Oh God, you see my track child. I have officially moved to Atlanta. It's been a month and I've been promising you guys that I was going to come back to YouTube. So I'm here. What's good? So yeah, still trying to like unpack. I feel like my house is a wreck, so I feel like I'm a wreck. You know, it's just like if your home isn't together. I don't know, I just, it just, it affects me. Bedroom is still getting done. We still got things to do. We don't have our linens. Everything's on back order. I'm trying to get used to this lighting. I don't think this side part is gonna work. Sorry for this yellow light, y'all. Yeah, ow. The side part wasn't working. Did it work? I think so. Let's go. All right, so is gonna be a normal, oh my God, the lighting goes from yellow to blue to, I'm sorry to y'all. I'm sorry. Tim's birthday is next week, so we're gonna be heading out of town. And um, I'll be vlogging that too, showing you guys how to travel during COVID. We're just really trying to get back to ourselves. I feel like the pandemic right after our wedding just kind of threw me for a loop, y'all. And I just finally feel like I'm getting back to myself, which is why I could be here. Because I just wasn't myself. Like, I would've just not recognized me. And if I'm sad, I don't want to give y'all energy that y'all don't need. And I feel like everybody was going through trying times. And I was like, child, let me just keep my, my stuff to myself, okay? But anyway. This is my future film room. I want y'all to see the mess that it is so y'all can give me my props for my cleaning abilities, okay? This thing is a mess, it's a mess. I haven't vlogged in so long just because I feel like my life is not that fun, but maybe it is. So, last appointment in an hour and a half. My best friend is here. Hi, bestie. Hi. Oh, she's right there. We have an apartment tour in a few minutes for my best day. Plus, she may be moving here to Atlanta, so she's doing like a virtual tour. They're gonna like just take her through the apartment virtually. Yeah, I'm about to hurry up and make us some breakfast. <laughs> and it's not gonna be no eggs and bacon. It's gonna be a smoothie. Cause we also are watching the bellies, okay? So I've been doing um, smoothie replacement for like the last week and a half. And adding my spinach. So it's basically like such a huge serving of fruit and vegetables in the morning and it just helps keep me flat and functioning, honey. Okay, so I've been using Daily Harvest just because again, I'm new to the city and um, my friend recommended it to me and I was just like <gasps> frozen, cool. You don't have to worry about it being in the fridge and not being as fresh as possible. And that's really important to me. So I love that I can just pull this straight from the freezer. And they literally pick the vegetables like at their peak and freeze it. So you're getting like the best veggies of all. And it's like a, a customizable box. Like you can just like pick your box, pick all the things that you want to go inside the box and you literally get it delivered to your door. I mean, how easy is that? And they have like, Bowls, ice cream. Oh wait, I almost forgot to tell you guys about my scoops, honey. It's made without fillers or gums and refined sugars, all the stuff that we don't need if we're trying to have as a little treat. So this one I'm really excited about. It's the coconut maple dark chocolate. And this is like minty fresh, okay? This one, I know Tim is gonna love. It's coconut maple with some avocado. This one is a rich rippled, a berry compote. And please don't mind all these little speckles in my freezer. That's just some, some kale that has escaped the Ziploc process, okay? And lastly, we have the coconut maple, which has black sesame, cacao, ashwaga, <laughs> vanilla. But yeah, I just have one of these, if, a scoop of these actually, if I'm feeling naughty. Smoothies for me, especially for breakfast, are just like fast fun, they taste good, and it gives me like a boost of energy, you know? Today, I'll be having my mango and papaya smoothie, and this one has mango, pineapple, I don't know how to pronounce this word, acerola, acelera, acerola, <laughs> papaya, and macadamia. So, what you wanna do is just take your smoothie, honey, and this is so easy. You literally just open this bad boy up. I mean, look at that. 
Look at that. Mm -hmm. Y'all wanna see? Y'all wanna see? Okay, one second, one second. So you guys can see, first of all, I'm about to take a piece of this right now. So I just, mm, you can see all the products in here. Super fresh, honey. So I just poured my water back into this cup here, and it's just gonna kind of loosen it up. And what I love about the cups too is you can pour your smoothie right back in here if you want. So I like to add some spinach to mine, just because I feel like I have to have a green smoothie for everything. So I take a good hearty handful of spinach. Yes, I'm having a salad, guys. So yeah, I like to put my spinach in here, and I'm also gonna take a scoop of protein. So then you're just gonna pour the rest of your ingredients inside. And we're gonna get to blending. All right. See, it's just, just painless. Mm-hmm. Girl, it's fun. The best part, guys, is if you wanna try Daily Harvest, you can use my code for $25 off. And I think this just works for women that just gotta go, honey. Have your smoothie for breakfast, you know. I have my apple cider vinegar right before that and some water. Salad for lunch and like a very like well-balanced dinner. And so far like the bloating has like subsided. Like I just feel light, I feel good. And I haven't had to take my caffeine pills, which is a blessing. I feel like with like COVID and everything that's happening right now, we're kind of just like neglecting ourselves and just not getting the proper nutrients. Not like eating balanced meals, we're stressed out. We're eating all the stuff that tastes good, that makes us feel good. Um, and that's why I just started with the smoothies because I, I could feel it in my body. Like I could feel myself like fading, like girl, girl. When's the last time you had some spinach? Okay, because sometimes you gotta check yourself. Alright guys, so I just got to the location for my lashes. I'm about to get lash. It's so cute in here, guys. Alright, I just sat down. Okay. I'm excited, y'all. It's been a long time. I have no hair on my lashes. I have like the world's shortest lashes. <laughs> Alright, y'all, I'm about to lay down. Hey girl. Hey. So we're about to get uh winked up, okay? <laughs> oh, we can take it. Guys, I'm do y'all see? Y'all can't see. Hold on, I gotta show you. Do y'all see these lashes, honey? <laughs> New T, who this? Look at how cute these are. I'm giving you June Ambrose tees. Tell me it's not a vibe with the mask, period, okay? All right, so somehow I ended up in sex, y'all. It's Tim's birthday month, so I need to buy him something child so I just bought him some Creed Aventus it is the best scent for your man honey um, so I got Creed Aventus and I got myself the Dubai gold um, super bomb everybody always asks me what I'm what I'm wearing so yeah um, I'm gonna look and see if I can find some sandals or like something else to wear cuz I gotta I gotta, I gotta look cute on vacation so thank you I'll hold you, I'm like blown because I'm literally waiting outside a store to make a purchase. It's not the rain. It's not the rain, I gotta hurry up. Do y'all like these? I don't know, I feel like my feet is too wide. And I'm ashy, child. I got a 40 and a half. And I feel like these look really good. They're a little big, but I think they look good. I gotta figure out how to hide this bag from Tim. <laughs> we got his gift in there, a little gift for me, you know. Just gotta camouflage. So now I'm about to head to physical therapy. Fun, right? Adulting. And I always have my snacks, honey. This is how you don't cheat on your diet. This is how you make sure you stay on track. So this is, um, half a cup of pistachios. Spicy chili. Oh my gosh, guys, look who I found. <laughs> my husband. So we're at the physical therapy spot. Um, I don't know what I thought this was gonna be, but Tim was like, you need workout clothes. <laughs> look at what I'm wearing. I'm like, I'm fine. All right, I don't know if I can record our session, but um, 
yeah, physical therapy time, adulting. <laughs> I'm gonna work on your lats. Terry just made your pecs, so all these muscles that wanna draw your shoulder in forward, I'm gonna stretch them out so they open up. That way it's not predisposing. You'll feel like you have more room in the front of your shoulder. Okay. Hurt so much. Totally relax. Let your body slump forward in bad posture. Breathe in. Exhale. Oh, wow. Keep those fingers into this good. Wow. <laughs> Great. Wow, I didn't even know I needed one. His eyes are sparkling. Breathe in. Exhale. Nice. Nice. The analogy in the camera. <laughs> but like if, her, if your butt sticks out just a little bit more, it makes your low back arch a tiny bit more. So when you arch, see these nerves right here? Yeah. The holes that the nerves um, come out of, like if they're normal, they're kind of open those holes. When you arch too much, it closes down on there. So it puts more pressure on the nerve. Yours would be theoretically like down here. Yeah, this is like where I think the pain is. Yeah. So all your exercises will be from the quads, imprinting your spine here, and doing all your exercises, dead bugs, straight leg raises, everything with your low back imprinted. Y'all want a big booty. There's drama attached. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Wait, Good one. What? Exhale. Oh. Exhale. Good. 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 Oh my goodness. Wow. You guys see what I look like? <laughs> wow. I feel 10 pounds lighter. Now we're gonna go celebrate and get some healthy food. Then I gotta go home and do some work. But we did it! That was amazing. Mm. Wait, it seems like every time I get to like a stop sign... There's a dragonfly? The fucking dragonflies be going crazy. They be wildin' out here. Alright, we going to my favorite spot so I can get my jackfruit. Mm -hmm. Hi kids. <laughs> Auntie and Uncle Tim here. I feel like a new person. I like my glasses, maybe. Are they by me or are they too big? Bye B. Bye gum all bad. I like the oversized. You do? Yeah. No no, it makes me feel like an auntie. <laughs> auntie T T like Brandon would say. <laughs> this is not meat, it's fruit. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Of course it's raining. Because you know, whenever I have straight hair, it just wants to rain here. It's ridiculous. Baby, my bundles. Oh no. Oh no. Just won't let me be great. Oh, so I came, I came down here to get the camera because we had our first blackout. But the lights are on. <laughs> oh, that was fast. <laughs> you guys scared? We need, we need candles. We do. We need candles. You guys scared? You got nervous? Yeah. Oh. I was nervous that, that you were going to be scared and I was sleep on No, I'd be unable to sleep because I'm hot. Because the AC is not on. <laughs> or the fan. Yeah, that would, that would stress me out. Baby's about to get a drink. Okay, so what we need to do is make sure we have candles and things in case of, you know, power outage. Yeah. Uh, where's all those, uh... Uh, I packed, I packed those, yeah. 
Probably under here somewhere. Yeah. You know, I was not gonna panic, guys. I was like, French Montana, don't panic. Don't panic. Cheers. Cheers. Our first blackout. Look at you being a vlog. Look at Tim, y'all. Y'all gotta give him some points. Yeah. Baby, is it me or is my dimple getting really big? Is that a normal thing? Like, I feel like I see it so much now. It's on that side. Yeah, but it, I don't feel like it was ever like this deep. Really? Yeah, I feel like I see it. Like, is that age? No. Am I losing <laughs> volume? No. You're the skin guy. No, you ain't losing no volume. Oh my God, it's so big now. I don't see it. That's what she said. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> We survived the blackout. We survived the blackout. Now it's time to have tequila. Don't be drinking all my tequila. Give me that. Give me that. Sophisticated. Oh, that's actually good. Yeah, get out of here. Baby. What? You were hating. Let me see. No. Let me see. Oh, <gasps> you really drank it all? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay. You're welcome. I like the same energy. I'm all. 